the OILK, driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. We continue the conversation. A little Western Wayne wrestling is uh, what we're talking. Ryan at Cabbage and Matthew Trigar live in studio with us. And uh, let's get Ryan up first. And uh, Ryan, uh, how much fun are you having right uh, right now with this wrestling team? Oh, we're having so much fun this year. We have a, an awesome group of kids again for this sport, and they're all just willing to be hard workers. And, uh, of course, a lot of success that we've seen Coach Dante Terenzio have there and try to get everybody kind of contagious about wrestling uh, just getting guys out and, and getting guys in the wrestling room uh, talk about trying to make it as contagious as you could to, to keep that tradition going well when we're running in the hallways and we see kids just walking we'll um we'll try to get them out for the sport and we'll just try to have as much fun as possible to try to get people to come join and we'll advertise during school to try to get more people out because we don't have we have a small group of kids this year but they're really talented kids great spirit at, at western wayne overall we've talked about this with track and field and and of course uh, you play some soccer as well but um trying to get people in the stands and, and kind of like that cheer group it's a it's a close-knit group although there's many miles between a lot of you guys there at western wayne it's a wide open school district um there's really kind of one heartbeat so to speak yeah and uh when we get people out for when we have the core group of fans basically our parents and we try to get a kids from our grades and grades below us to come out and support us by telling them during school that we have big matches coming up and some of them come through and come support our team and uh tell us a little bit about your teammate we'll talk to him in a moment but tell us about uh matt matthew tragar tragar what uh, what he's like he's a really hard worker he's a really fun kid and i think it's really fun having him on the team because we just have a lot of fun together and there's a few more kids that we just have a lot of fun during wrestling practice, and it makes it ten times better. How about the soccer wise? Can he play that game as well? Oh yeah, he can. He can play the game. He's a very aggressive player. He uh, he's able to shoot a ball really hard and where place it where he wants, and it's he just makes the sports very fun that we're in. How about your future endeavors, boy? You're well rounded. You're doing the soccer. You're doing the wrestling. You're doing the track and field. Uh, what's next for you? Uh, I'm. Deciding to play soccer at Marywood University, and I'm going to be signing with them sometime soon. Right. And uh, how about a major? Uh, right now, I'm either going to go in as undecided or something with the nursing program. Right. A lot of nursing uh, uh, field interest in the last uh, couple of uh, weeks, it seems. I've had mm -hmm. uh, girls, guys, everybody kind of into it. So yeah. looks like there's some job opportunities uh, in that field. And uh, we wish you the best, uh, so yeah, we'll head over to Matthew now. Thank you. All right, let's uh, talk with Matthew Trigar from the Western Wayne Wrestling Team. And uh, Matthew, what kind of fun are, are you having this season? Um, I'm having lots of fun. Uh, since it's my senior year, I've been trying to really look at the positive sides. Um, I've been, you know, the team is really, they're they're very different this year. You know, we, we really worked hard, really hard in the past couple of years but this year we have a lot more fun with it um you know me and ryan we mess around with coach a lot it's a lot of fun i talk about uh, what weight you're wrestling at and of course your teammate ryan at cabbage where's he at and, and kind of filling out some of those weights in your area um i'm wrestling at like 182 195 um you know depending on the match and ryan's wrestling at like 170 like 160 area and He's doing pretty good at that area. Um, I think that's a really good spot for him because um, he's a really tough. He's really fast. It's it's um in my weight class. It's been it's been pretty hard because he's bigger kids, but it's it's kind of where I want it to be. And Ryan's doing really well at the spot right now. You guys get to partner up and practice, kind of push each other a little bit. Yeah, me and him, we get to partner up of um. Like every once in a while, usually he's with a couple other kids, but usually when me and him get together, it's pretty, it's pretty rough wrestling, or it's just a lot of fun to wrestle him. What's it like watching him on the soccer field and then seeing him on the wrestling mat and, and that friendship you guys have? Uh, uh, what kind of athlete uh, would you say Ryan is? Ryan is probably one of the best athletes I've seen in our school in a long time. Um, on the soccer field, he's quick. He he knows how to play the game. He knows. He picked it up really fast, especially with wrestling. He picked up wrestling really fast. Um, you know, I never expected him to come out the way he has this year, but he really, he really turned into be a really good wrestler. Yeah, and as far as uh, your future endeavors, what's next for you? Um, 
I'm not really sure where I want to go yet, but I'm looking at film schools. Um, I'm really interested in filming and editing and all that, but um, Temple seems to be top on my list, Hofstra and Pace. So I'm not going to be playing any sports down there because, you know, school um, is going to come first for me. Well, it sounds like you got your act together in the classroom, though, so that's always uh, always important. So uh, we mm-hmm. wish you well there in your future endeavors. Thank you. All right, and volleyball uh, is also a sport you play. What do you like about playing volleyball? Uh, volleyball is <laughs> it's it's a really relaxed sport. It's something that like I don't have to you know go to the wrestling every day and really focus and push myself really hard. It's something that I can relax, sit back, and think about and have a lot of fun. The team is very they're relaxed too. There's just it's a lot of um, it's a good atmosphere to be in. Yeah. Well, we'll uh, go get them, all right, in volleyball season. <laughs> Ryan, I want to get you back in here, track and field. What uh, what events are you going to be competing in on the track and field come spring? This year I'm hoping to be back in the 4x4. I'm doing pole vaulting, the 110 hurdles, 300 hurdles, and probably, hopefully, mixed in some of the sprints. All right, well, we, uh, we appreciate you guys coming in today all the way from Western Wayne. Have a safe trip back and continued success there with the rest of wrestling season, okay? Thank you for having us. Okay, Ryan at Cabbage and, of course, uh, Matthew Trigar from the Western Wayne wrestling team. And, uh, again, multi-sport guys and do a good job in the classroom as well. Well, we appreciate you joining us here on the John Mandola Show, driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers each and every Saturday between 10 and 11 o'clock, of course, online during the week. The JohnMandolaShow.com. Follow us on Twitter at JohnMandolaShow, and we'll get to some of more uh, interviews coming up during the week. Of course, next Saturday between 10 and 11, things are going to heat up a little bit. Hey, we're in February next week. Our last show here in January as we continue that conversation, the playoffs will heat up. Swimming, diving, wrestling, all that good stuff, and some local college basketball going on here in northeastern Pennsylvania as well. So uh, great to see you. Of course, uh, great to see you, my uh, nephew in town, Zachary Mandola, for coming in this morning, getting a little background music here on the John Mandola Show. I want to tell everybody to have a super day as we head out now to our local State Farm insurance agent, Daryl Hubbard. Break like a good neighbor. Daryl Hubbard is there. Have a good one from everybody here at WILK.